In this video I will give you multiple tips, recommended transfers and certain objectives you can use if you want to do a Wolfsburg career mode in FIFA 23. And after watching this video you can rebuild Wolfsburg in FIFA 23 and bring them back to Bundesliga title winning glory. The first step on how you can rebuild Wolfsburg is to try and relive some history of the club. In the 2008-09 season Wolfsburg won their first and to this day only Bundesliga title. With possible the most lethal strike duo in Bundesliga history, Brazilian striker Grafit and Bosnian striker Edin Dzeko scored 82% of all Wolfsburg goals in this magical season. They were signed for a combined 10 million euros and they scored 54 goals between them in this season. With this amount they beat the record of Bayern Munich's Gerd Müller and Uli Hunes, who scored 53 goals together in 1973. Grafit ended up as league top goalscorer with 28 goals with Edin Dzeko finishing in second place with 26 goals. The main goal when rebuilding Wolfsburg in FIFA 23 career mode is of course to once again win the Bundesliga. You can also try to recreate the iconic strike duo they once had with a Brazilian striker and a Bosnian striker. Or you can also decide to just have one striker who is a bit more agile and one other striker who is more physical and who is taller. In terms of recommended transfers for this strike duo, I would recommend the following Brazilian strikers. Caio Jorge is 20 years old and he plays for Juventus. He is 71 rated and has 82 potential and he is valued at 4.1 million euros. Evan Nielsen is another big talent from FC Porto. He is 78 rated and has 86 potential and he is 22 years of age. He is valued at 32 million euros. Chao Pedro is a 20 year old striker who plays for Watford and he is 71 rated and also has 84 potential. He has a scanned game face and he is valued at 4.5 million euros. If you want to sign a suitable Bosnian striker then there aren't many options. Ermanen Demirovic is 24 years old and he now plays for Augsburg. He is 73 rated and has 78 potential and he is valued at 4.7 million euros. But you can of course try to resign add in Checo and make him play for Wolfsburg again. Although he might retire soon in career mode you might just get another two seasons out of him. He is 36 years old and 84 rated and he is valued at 14.5 million euros. You can of course also use the youth academy to find a suitable Brazilian striker. Unfortunately you can't scout in Bosnia though. But if you are looking to have one more pacey and agile striker and one more tall physical striker then I would recommend the following players. Omar Marmouche already plays for Wolfsburg and he has 85 pace and 91 agility from the start. He is 73 rated, 23 years old and has 81 potential. So why not give him a try before spending unnecessary money. Lucas and Matcha also already plays at Wolfsburg and he is 78 rated and has 83 potential. He has 82 pace and 73 agility but is still a great play to turn into one of the paciest players in the game. He also has 3 star skill moves and 4 star weak foot and both him and Marmouche have his scanned game face in the game. Geraldo Becker is one of the most standout players in the Bundesliga this season in real life as he is doing great for Union Berlin. Becker is a Surinamese striker who is 78 rated. He is 27 years old and also has 78 potential. But he can of course still grow with dynamic potential. He currently has 95 pace and 78 agility and he is valued at 15 million euros. In terms of physical strikers I would suggest Daryl DK. He is a 22 year old American striker who plays for West Brom in the championship. He is 71 rated and has 82 potential and he has 96 strength. He is valued at 4.2 million euros. Sasa Kalajic is a 24 year old Austrian striker who now plays for Wolves in the Premier League. He is 2 meters tall, has 83 strength and he is valued at 19.5 million euros. He is 78 rated and has 81 potential and he also has a scanned game face. Shvestan Misimovic was the attacking midfielder who played behind Grafit and Erin Dzeko. The Bosnian provided a record breaking 20 assists in the title winning season. You can also try to recreate and sign another Bosnian midfielder who can help provide the assists for the new strike duo. Although the options are limited, Gare Krunic currently plays for AC Milan and he is a 28 year old central midfielder. He is 77 rated and also has the same potential and he is valued at 10.5 million euros. The formation that was mostly used by Wolfsburg in the 2008-09 season was the 4-1-2-1-2 formation without wingers. The team has to be built upon every player working very hard in every match and giving it their all. Especially the wingbacks who need to cover a lot of ground both defensively and offensively. Make sure your two central midfielders also have very good stamina as these two are the two box to box midfielders who need to be everywhere on the pitch as well. I will give you 4 seasons to win the Bundesliga again with Wolfsburg in FIFA 23 career mode. Try to complete the following objectives as well 
just to make it a bit more difficult and maybe even a little bit more realistic as well. The first objective to use in the save, besides winning the Bundesliga of course, is to make sure both of your strikers become the first and second top goalscorer in the league in the Bundesliga title winning season. Secondly, break the record amount of goals both Kravit and Czechu scored between them of 54 by having both strikers score at least 55 goals or more in the title winning season. Thirdly, you cannot lose a match when playing at home as Wolfsburg won 16 out of the 17 home matches in the Bundesliga winning season. Also, try to break Misimovic's amount of assists he gave in the title winning season, which was 20, by assisting at least 21 goals in your title winning season. For the first two seasons, you can add a rule that you have to sell your players when an offer from a bigger club comes in. Of course, you don't have to sell your Grafit, Chaco and Misimovic replacements. If you can hold on to most players, make sure there are at least 6 of the current Wolfsburg players in your starting 11 at the end of this career mode. Sign a maximum of 4 new players each season. Make sure these new signings aren't the biggest wonder kids and sign more hidden gem type of players as that makes a career mode a lot more fun. Just to give a bit more information about Wolfsburg in FIFA 23, they have some nice kits you can use throughout this career mode. They also have the real stadium in the game which helps a lot with immersion and of course the Bundesliga also has their official broadcast package in the game. The rival team of Wolfsburg according to FIFA 23 is Hannover 96, although they play in the second Bundesliga. If you do however face them at some point during this career mode then be sure to not lose that match. If you do you can add a rule that you have to sell one of your starting level players in the next transfer window, of course with the exception of selling your Grafit, Czako and Misimovic replacements. When loading up the save you already start this career mode with a 50 million transfer budget, although it would be quite unrealistic to spend it all in the first season. There are 70 players in the current Wolfsburg squad who have a scanned game face which makes Wolfsburg an even better team to use in career mode. And a fun storyline you can use is to keep both Unmatcher brothers at the club. Lucas Unmatcher currently already plays in the starting level while his younger brother Felix and Mecha still has to improve in some areas. It could be fun to have both brothers at the end of this career mode when you win the Bundesliga. If you have any other objectives or rules to add to a rebuild with Wolfsburg in FIFA 23 career mode then let me know in the comments. If you found this video helpful be sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel to help me get to 20,000 subscribers and I will see you at the next video.